Let me go ahead and turn this on because I have it. Might as well do it, you know. <clears throat> New bases. What's going on? It's Alan Brown, aka Ruler the Kid. And today we have an unboxing. But we'll get to that right after this intro. Okay, so thank God for sticking through the intro. As you can see, this is from Harley Benton. And um, I peaked this base probably about a year ago. No lie. I seen it. It was a dope colorway. And I think this is the base it is. I can't confirm it. <laughs> so we gonna see what it is. Um, yeah, let's just take the good old keys because that's a trusty tried and true joint. Take my old house key and come in here like this. That's good. That's good. Dang, just one one piece of tape to protect this bamboo. I guess so. comes with the cord, a uh, little, I guess, six foot cord, ten foot cord, whatever. Uh, what else is in here? In case of emergency. <laughs> in case of emergency. Rescue my guitars. <laughs> that was obviously funny. All right, cool. Um, the Allen keys to do uh, minor adjustments or major adjustments just depends on the instrument. And here we go. <laughs> yeah, boy. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Quality inspection. Little sticker. Whatever. Dope. Checked out by uh, Inspector 2220. So, for you, thank you, 2220. Two 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 zero. I appreciate that. Um, this is a Harley Benton Standard Series P base, but it's in like a matte black or matte gray situation. I'm not gonna lie to you. This pick guard is gonna go, and I'm gonna throw something spicier on that bad boy. So, uh, out the gate, this is already nasty. <laughs> this pick guard's going to go, though, and I'm going to show you the options as to what I'm going to do. Just wait a second. <laughs> so many options and so little time. <laughs> Here we go. Choose a card, any card. <laughs> oh, let's see. Black on pearl white. Could that look fire? I don't know. What you think? Black 
on pearl on it. That looks pretty, that looks pretty fire. Okay. Set that to the side. Ah, black on gold. I'm a Sigma, I can't do that. Black on purple? Let's see that. Let's see if that looks pretty good. And then I'll just uh, trim it up to make it look right for what I got. Black on purple? Uh, contender. Contender, contender, contender. Classic. Nothing wrong with this. Nothing wrong with this. There's nothing wrong with this at all. The black on white. Doesn't look bad. Doesn't look bad at all. Contender. I don't know though. There's so many options that I can go with. Oh, let's see. Oh, you're so sexy. I'll save you for last. Oh. Yeah, dude. That looks the part. The black on blue. Black on blue, perloid joint. Yeah. Ah, and then there is the sexy one. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. Look at it. Just take a look at it. You don't got to see me. Just feel every piece of what's going on right now. Ah. <sighs> Test fit. Test fit. Doesn't really, doesn't really stick out like talking about. Like you got to get in there to 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 really love it like it needs to be loved. But uh, that looks pretty good too. I don't know, man. I don't know. So, plans for this bass. I haven't even played this bass yet, and I already know that I'm going to go ahead and throw in the Seymour Duncan Quarter Pounders in this bad boy because it needs it. I haven't even played it, and it may not need it, but it needs it. You get what I'm saying? Uh, so, I really don't know. I don't know if I actually want to swap the pickup in this bad boy or not, but I feel like I'm going to swap it anyway because, yeah. later. Yes. Yes, sir. This is ready to go right now. Like, how it's set up right now. I can deal with this right now. later. One eternity later. Ah.
<sighs> now, with that being said, pick a pipe. You're already popping. It is too high. Out the box. This bass. But playability, funkability. Off the charts, bro. <laughs> Off the charts. And I think this cost me like just over a hundred bucks. Like, and that's just for the colorway. Like, I was just as happy with the uh $84 Harley Benton joint that I had that was just like uh shiny black with a maple neck, whatever, whatever, whatever. But this, I'm keeping this. This is me. I'm keeping this. This is my base. I'm throwing up the uh, Seymour Dungas in this bad boy. Hell, tomorrow. <laughs> I got him up there. Yes, this is happening. Seymour Dungas are going in this bad boy. And it is on this coming Sunday. Yeah, so I need to bring the uh, camera to the church because it's going to be gross and I'm trying to play all day Sunday. This is this is ridiculous how good this feels and I'm going to play four string. Oh, it's a P-bass neck and it just feels right. Like I feel like I've had it forever. <laughs> and I'm taking that set up. Elf. New base cab. That's how I'm coming. Yeah, man. This is going to be dope. And that was flat. I'm going to leave it alone. That was at 25% uh, time. <sighs> With the strings that came fresh out the pack. Definitely going to be playing this bad boy Sunday. So videos subsequently after this video will be added and I'll be using this bad boy because why not? You know, if you got an ax, might as well go ahead and just swing it. <laughs> so yeah, this is, this, this is, yeah, this is, yeah, I'm not getting rid of this bass. This is my bass. This is, I'm going to soup it up. It's going to be gross. It's going to be disgusting. I'm going to do things. Things are going to be done. So, yeah, it's, it's, a, <sighs> I just wish Harley Benton would talk to me so that I could demo their basses because this, at a hundred dollars is better than a lot of bases that I've got for two hundred dollars more. Jesus. Anyway, <sighs> I've been Alan Brian K. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for watching for as long as you do. Um, Till next time. Ha, 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 ha,